Hi everyone. I'm back today. So I wanted to cover the Nicki Minaj. Okay, we got flying cars coming out. Someone wants stability. Someone wants a marriage or wants something long term here or wants a family here. This is about Nicki Minaj and her quote unquote new boyfriend. Um, I haven't heard anything. No, I haven't heard any good news about him. Um, I've heard that he um, has ran into some issues in the past, um, in his younger days, in regards to some type of uh, rape, using a weapon, a knife. So that really didn't sit well with me. And I'm just wondering, like, why does she always run into these type of guys that carry that type of energy and I, I mean i know she had that situation going on with her brother and then i i think it was six nine i don't want i really don't didn't read up on six nine and uh all of the issues that were going on um but from my understanding she keeps um attracting these type of men okay so I'm just curious. I do like Nicki Minaj. I am a Nicki Minaj fan. Um, so none of this is directed towards, oh, like I'm, I don't like Nicki. I love Nicki. I just want to get some tea. Okay. So let's see what's going on. Let's see. Her new boyfriend. Well, um, I don't think anyone is really sure whether or not it's her boyfriend or not, but I think his name is um, Zoo Petty. So I want to know how does he feel about Nicki Minaj? They could be doing business because from what I'm, from my understanding, I heard that um, they could be doing business together, or it could be something love related. Not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure. No one is really sure except for the ones that are in it, right? But let's take a look. So how does what I said that dude name was again, I'd be forgetting the names. Zoo Petty, yeah. That's what they call him. But I think his his last name really is Petty, I think. Um, so I want to know how he feels about Nicki Minaj. Give me a card for how he feels about Nicki Minaj. Okay, so let's see. Guys, we have engagement here. All right, so your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Now, when I was getting ready, when I was shuffling the cards, we had the nine of cups and the four of pentacles. So this is someone who is wanting marriage, someone that is wanting stability or wanting something long term, okay, or wanting a family. So maybe he does want to level up with Nicki Minaj, okay? But that's Nicki Minaj, you know. You deserve love. You are lovable. And I'm going to pull one more. We have playfulness, all right? So to recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit um, to shine, all right? So they could be having lots of fun together. You know, they might have a really fun relationship. Um, but why is engagement here? Why is engagement here? Please give me clarifiers. How does Zoo Petty feel about Nicki Minaj? Okay. I feel like some heart, I feel like some truth, it's a heartbreaking truth or um, the truth about a third party situation here as well, or there could have been a breakup or I feel like there could some truth um, needs to be revealed or could come out. Hmm. I think Nicki Minaj is a Sagittarius. She just just had a birthday here. I do feel like 
here with engagement, we have the seven of wands. So this is standing your ground, defending yourself, protecting. This is like protection. So maybe he is um, committed to defending her or protecting her. I did hear that as well, that maybe she hired him as like a bodyguard or for protection. Um, so that could be the, the level of commitment or something that he committed to do for her. Presently, we have you deserve love. So we have the Ace of Wands. So this is a new start, okay? This is a fresh new beginning, okay? So he does feel like, you know, she's lovable. The whole world loves her here with this world card. She's successful. You know, um, going into the near future, I do feel like here with playfulness, with this nine of wands, this is like, watch your back, okay? This is like, your guard is up. So he's going to be careful how he does, how he plays with her, with this queen of wands. He's going to be on his P's and Q's. Right. He's going to decide not to play with her, with this two of swords. This two of swords is saying, I'm not, or this is indecision. Okay, so I feel like he is is very cautious with her it's gonna be very cautious so it sounds like to me like it could be business with a little bit of playfulness with it how does Nicki minaj feel about zupetti How's Nicki Minaj feel about her new boo thing? Her new boo boo. <laughs> How does Nicki Minaj feel about her new boyfriend or friend, Zoo Petty? Bottom of the deck is the Page of Pentacles. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn's energy. Um, but this is the beginning stages. So there's something fresh and new about this. This is like building from the ground up. This is starting over. Something like, you know, change. And um, I'm feeling like starting fresh. I'm sensing like change here with this Wheel of Fortune and Ten of Cups and a Page of Pentacles. This is like starting fresh. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I feel like there's a sense of wanting to find balance or healing here in this situation with this temperance card. This is the card of Sagittarius as well. Why is the temperance card here? Okay, the chariot card, which is the card of cancer, but this is progress and forward movement. So this, is, this has to do with finding balance and or healing on a situation and progressing. So this is about progression here. She feels like he's progression, progressing, I'm sorry. The challenge here being this emperor card, this is the card of Aries, but this talks about having everything under control, okay? Being a boss. Yeah. King of Swords. This is definitely serious energy. So she, I feel like she may feel as if he's very stern and straightforward, um, very logical. Um, maybe she feels like she can bring some type of balance to that to help this to help the situation or what he's trying to accomplish um, moving forward. I do feel like they are possibly in a relationship. We got the Ten of Pentacles which is security. Um, this is the relationship card. It's paired up here with the lover's card. Okay, so I do feel like they are possibly in a relationship. I feel like he has even proposed 
or put that out in the atmosphere um, of proposing to her here with this knight of cups okay this is this is an offer okay this is communication coming in we have the four of pen, four of wands again now this could be family so he could be you know they could be talking to family um or getting to know you know getting to know each other's family but i feel like this is an engagement or it talks about marriage okay that's what i'm feeling like but what's in the desires is whether or not this is going to be temporary here with this um knight of wands and the seven of swords this is definitely like sneaky type energy this is definitely most definitely sneaky type energy you know just waiting for waiting to see if this is going if this is a sham if this is fake but i do feel like it's going to take a lot of courage a lot of balls or it's going to take a lot to to hold her down basically what's going into the near future we have the ten of wands okay so this is this talks about something having a lot of something this is also talks about a burden or carrying a heavy load okay um the clarifying card is the strength card which is the card of leo but this talks about being bold okay having the courage and with this eight of swords this is to lock it down this is what i'm sensing it's going to take a lot for her to, you know, feel like, okay, you can lock this down. I'm sensing that. I feel like he's been telling her that he wants to marry her. Why is the Eight of Swords here? Okay. We have the Devil card. Okay. This is the card of Capricorn. But paired up here with this Eight of Swords, this is definitely like possessed to own to own me i'm telling you she's saying she's feeling like it's going to take a lot to feel as if you know like you have me she's waiting to see if this is going to be temporary but i do feel like i do feel like they are in uh you know they have started a relationship or they're you know working on it i feel like it's something that they're working on you go girl now i also want to see how does Nicki minaj feel about cardi b and her split from offset all right so everybody knows that you know they're kind of rivals i wish they'll come together and make some great music but it's doesn't always work out that way. So, I want to see how does Nicki Minaj feel about Cardi B? How does Nicki Minaj feel about Cardi B and Offset splitting? How does Nicki Minaj feel about Cardi B and Offset splitting? All right, we got Jumper. All right, we got the Seven of Pentacles. All right, so this is being patient, okay? This is... Um, and it's funny because at the bottom of the deck is the sun card. These cards go hand in hand because this card speaks about planting your seeds and plotting. Okay. And the sun card is you need the sun for these seeds that you planted to grow. So I'm sensing like a plot, a twist. I do feel like I do feel like Nicki Minaj. Um from my understanding is Nicki Minaj um, has spoken about that she's, you know, she kind of already heard that um, Offset was cheating and this, this, that. So it's a lot of, of other things that are being said as well, which I won't go into because I don't, y'all can do your own research when it comes to that. It's all over the internet. All you got to do is type it in on YouTube or Google. But let's see. I want to see how does Nicki Minaj feel about Cardi being offset splitting. She's 
she feels like it's going to be temporary. Here, this Knight of Wands. I think she feels like it's going to be temporary. Yeah. Um, she does, just like everybody else know, you know, the first card we have here is that Seven of Swords. So this is talks about cheating, okay? Lying, being a liar, being a cheat. And it's causing issues, okay? Possibly competition, other women competing, okay? And this Empress card is other women, okay? And this is why it's happening. Because someone is lying and being a cheat and got caught. I, however, yeah. This is definitely like the other, other women here with this Queen of Wands and this Empress. Definitely other women energy. I do feel like she don't have no regrets. Like she don't feel sorry. Um, she doesn't feel sorry about it. We have the two of swords and the two of swords talks about when you're not doing something, when you're indecisive or you're not doing something. She does not have any regrets here with this five of cups. Mind you, these two are rivals. Like they, they're constantly going back and forth. So this type of this type of energy is definitely expected from you know I expected to see this type of energy, but I do feel like she does she does feel like I feel like she thinks she feels like they're going to get back together, but I'm since they like try to come together as friends and talk about it. Going into the near future, we have the Eight of Pentacles. Okay, so this is putting in effort. This is working towards something, but this is definitely putting in effort. The Eight of Wands talks about communication. Okay, so maybe she's going to try to talk to Cardi here with this Three of Cups. And this talks about friendship, okay? This talks about a circle, um, a friendship getting together. So maybe she's going to try to reach out to Cardi or she's going to um, try to find a way to, I feel like she's going to try to make friends with her or get a friend to reach out to her or something to in, in, in that nature. But I feel like she does not. I feel like she doesn't feel sorry. She doesn't have any regrets here. Why is the five of wands here? Okay. The nine of swords. So this is worry. You know, I feel like. She feels like Cardi is stressing now about the situation. She feels like she's stressed. She's worried. This part, this is keeping her up all night here with this nine of swords. It's just drama. Especially this rings drama when I see five of swords and the nine, five of wands and the nine of swords. This is just like drama. This is like when you are just like overly overthinking it in your head. And it's just, you're manifesting what you're thinking. I feel like, I really do feel like she's going to try to try to talk to her or be friendly towards her. Maybe like, be, I'm just sensing, I'm just sensing like, I feel like she's going to try to be friendly with, with Cardi, um, going into the near future all right guys let me know what you guys think in the comment section below all right ciao for now